Imagine a cosmic dance, a celestial waltz of three heavenly bodies, each tugging and pulling at the others with the invisible threads of gravity. It's a problem that has puzzled scientists for centuries and continues to challenge our understanding of the universe, the three-body problem. But what exactly is this problem? Why does it baffle even the brightest minds? And is it truly unsolvable? To understand the three-body problem, let's start with a simpler case. Picture a planet orbiting a star. The gravitational pull between the two can be precisely calculated, resulting in predictable, often elliptical orbits. This two-body system is well understood thanks to the laws of motion and gravity first laid out by Sir Isaac Newton. However, when a third body enters the system, everything changes. Introducing a third body into the gravitational interaction disrupts the simplicity. Each body exerts a force on the others, creating a complex, ever-changing web of gravitational poles. The result? An unpredictable, often chaotic system. The free body problem is the first real worry of Newton, says Billy Quarles, a planetary dynamicist at Valdosta State University in Georgia. In essence, the movement of each body becomes highly sensitive to its initial conditions, their positions, velocities, and masses. A slight change in any of these factors can lead to dramatically different outcomes. Unlike the two-body problem, which has neat mathematical solutions, the three-body problem defies straightforward equations. Shane Ross, an applied mathematician at Virginia Tech, explains it with a vivid analogy. It's like walking on a mountain ridge. One small step could send you tumbling down either side. The initial positions might be close, but the results can be vastly different. Despite its inherent complexity, some special cases of the three-body problem have been solved. For example, if three bodies of equal mass are arranged just right, they can trace out a beautiful figure-eight pattern in space. These solutions, however, are rare exceptions rather than the rule. In the realm of science fiction, such as Netflix's three-body problem, we encounter even more complex scenarios. This show features a planet trapped in the gravitational turmoil of three stars. But can such a world sustain life or even exist in reality? Ross suggests otherwise. I don't think in that type of situation that's a stable environment for life to evolve. The chaotic nature of the orbits likely precludes any stable conditions necessary for life as we know it. In some instances, the problem can be simplified. Consider the fictional planet Tatooine from Star Wars orbiting two suns. If the planet's orbit is sufficiently distant, it might be possible to treat the two stars as a single, larger body, reducing the problem to a more manageable two-body interaction. This simplification holds true in real-world astronomy as well, where over a dozen Tatooine-like exoplanets have been discovered. More often than not, the instability of three-body systems leads to dramatic outcomes. The gravitational forces might cause two bodies to collide or eject one body from the system entirely, potentially explaining the existence of rogue planets. Planets wandering the galaxy without a star to call home. Scientists estimate that there could be 20 times more rogue planets than stars in our galaxy. With the advent of modern computing, scientists can now approximate the motions of bodies in three body systems using numerical simulations. These computational methods allow us to predict the paths of rockets, the stability of planetary orbits, and even the fate of entire solar systems. So, is the three body problem truly unsolvable? The answer is nuanced. While no general analytical solution 
exists for all possible initial conditions. Specific cases can be solved, and modern computational techniques offer powerful tools to tackle individual scenarios. The problem remains a fascinating blend of chaos and order, a reminder of the complexity and beauty of the universe we inhabit.